Zach, perfect timing. You remember Abby Goodman, friend of mine you helped before? Yeah, of course. Is she really your friend, or all just part of the cover you had going on? No, <laughs> no. <laughs> she is. She's a spy for Noctis too, though. She's actually been working on something for me and finally managed to get some info I'd been trying to get. What information was that? I... I spent a part of my life in a rehabilitation camp after my arrest in Ophir. It was the worst time of my existence, and I've always wondered how I'd ended up here. Who had turned us in? We were just a group of street kids. We would steal food here and there, but we weren't dangerous. However, we were arrested and deported to a camp like hardened criminals or terrorists. What happened followed me for many years, until I learned that an important member of the Vori clique was responsible for the deportation of dozens of people. Most of them were innocent, but a nuisance for the mob. I want to find that guy. I want to know if it's he who got us deported. I want to understand why, and make him pay. For me, and my companions, of course, but also for those poor people who hadn't asked for anything. I understand. That man seems to be a real scumbag. I'll help you find him. Thank you, Zack. want to confirm we're going to move for a complete takeover there are strong ties between you technomancers something not hey there you from noctis don't seem like a merchant yes and no here on a private matter you by any chance know the underworks well enough even here there's rules that forbid us to go to certain parts of the city but in these tunnels they become little more than technicalities I'm looking to get to the Technomancer's Chapel. There's an entrance in the crypt, but I don't know how to get there. Well, I can show you the tunnels under the source. Once upon a time, I used to smuggle merchandise through there. Remember hearing about some magical gate down there, too? I take it it's the kind of gate only your kind can open? <laughs> yeah, I've run into a few of those along my travels. I'll show you on a map. Be careful, Mr. Technomancer. The tunnels have always been guarded. Now it's probably even worse. Word is that the ASC's forced its way into the chapel's main entrance. I'm gonna need another Technomancer to help me open this gate. Or find another way in. I'm sure it won't be easy, but thanks for the help. It's gonna do a lot of good. Good luck. Good luck.
Raider! Get him! I've seen that look before, Nisha. It's a look of revenge. I know all about hatred, scorn, but believe me, it isn't the wisest place to draw motivation. You're right. But these questions have been buried far too long. Your mind has been set. I respect that. We'll go and dig up your answers, but heed my warning. No amount of dirt will satisfy you. What are you doing here? This is private property, and you have no business here. We don't give a damn about your warehouse. What we want are answers, and like it or not, you're gonna talk. Come on, guys, let's go! <laughs> Very well. You're the one who used to turn in people who were an obstacle to the ASC, right? The one who was sending innocents to rehabilitation camps? No. No, look, it's way more complicated than that. Yeah, sure, I was in charge of making up evidence back when proof was needed to frame some of them. But with the ASC out there headhunting, now all you gotta do is send an anonymous letter to get someone deported. But most of the time, it wasn't I who was in charge of deciding who had to leave. We would get together and present those who might threaten us. It wasn't a single man's decision. Anton wasn't our chief yet. Not most of the time, but it happened. You sent a bunch of street kids straight to a camp, and I don't see what threat they represented, so? Why? Personal vengeance? What the hell did they do to you? Nothing, but a girl from that gang came to see me. She told me that another kid had overheard us, and she wanted to turn us in. It was believable. And since that snot-nosed kid could have talked about it with his gang, I turned in the whole group. You're lying. It doesn't make sense. None of us would have turned in someone in the group. I know what I'm talking about. Why would I lie to you? The kid, I, I, I think her name was Gloria. You lie! Gloria would have never done anything like that, you son of a... You're gonna die, scumbag. Nisha, you were that guy's victim. You're the only one who knows what to do. <clears throat> I know you prefer for us to shut it, but Nisha, do not let such new questions torture you for even more years. This time, find your answers quickly. It can't be. I can't. I... 